so we are going to the north side of Rovaniemi, about half an hour drive to a very private place uh, where there are not, no lights, no street lights, nothing, it's totally dark. It's been growing a lot. When I started it for five years ago, it was uh, yeah, relatively calm and uh, small groups only, and uh, there were not so many tour operators as it is now. So now there are tons of different tour operators in, uh, in the city, and also the tourism amount, the tourism numbers have been growing like every year. We have experienced really like good northern lights, uh, like for night after night, uh, like really big northern lights and uh, good activity. And um, yeah, it's like I have never experienced uh, during my five year career, I, I haven't experienced like this big and this frequent northern lights. So yeah, it has been really good. It's stunning. I mean, it's something you have to see in your life. It's beautiful. You don't want to leave. You want to just see more and more. We are quite far north here in Finland, so the northern lights are more common in these high latitude regions and especially in the Lapland region here in Finland, we, we get the northern lights almost every night. Here we can see the last solar cycle and then here is the current solar cycle. So here we can see that we are at higher levels than in the last cycle. Usually it means more intense geomagnetic storms uh, because these coronal mass ejections, they, uh, they are these big balls of plasma that are ejected from the sun and when this plasma uh, reaches Earth's magnetic field, uh, it causes geomagnetic storms here. Uh, on Earth. So during the solar maximum we get more of these CMEs and yeah, more intense geomagnetic storms also and also more northern lights. So we get more of everything. <laughs>
I have my own cameras and they send uh, images to my server and my software analyzes is there errors or not. And if there is errors, customer gets alerts to their phone, mobile phone. Very easy to switch on, switch on, off, and Aurora, forecasts. There is almost every night, if the sky is clear, is some sort of auroras. And especially in autumn, there was great auroras.